What's up, people? Welcome to Cortez Talk. This right here is my Kanye West. I got a few things I gotta say about him, so I wrote this little letter right here. First, before I say, no, I'm not trying to hate on him. I am a true fan of Kanye West. It's just some things I just don't like about him. And I see a major change in him. I think an Illuminati probably took over him. That Rockefeller, you know, that all this and shit, you know, dealing with the Illuminati, I'm thinking that that probably changed his life, you know, and that's fucked up. But I'm just being real with you. So if you want to hate, just like this video, like this video, you see where I'm coming from. All right, number one, what happened to your music? What happened to your music? I remember the old Kanye West, I'm talking about the Kanye West that was like three years ago. The Kanye West that had the college dropout. You know, late registration, all them good albums back then, back there when you had like little teddy bear and shit, you know, I thought the teddy bear logo was gay, you feel me, but you, you different from everybody, you know, you, Trinidad James, y'all, both of y'all niggas, y'all just different, but what happened to your music, you feel me, because back then I used to bump to your music, because some of the shit that you was expressing in your music, I can kind of relate on, but right now it's like you just saying anything it's like you possess it's like the Illuminati just took over you you and Jay-Z and shit but lots of people tell me that Jay-Z is the is the Illuminati but me I don't really know but if that's true that's fucked up and the devil got you alright number two why the fuck you got a leather skirt on you know that's fucked up right there, you know. You fucking up the whole hip hop game wearing a leather skirt. All right. You could have just wore leather pants or some shit like that. Why why wear a skirt? What, next week you gonna have a dress on, leather dress? I don't know, you know. I wasn't even expecting for you to wear a skirt, first of all. You feel me? If I was going to your concert, all right, I'm spending like, what, $60, $70 for a ticket. I'm coming there to watch you perform. Not to watch you wear a damn skirt. I'm just being real. And for y'all niggas that's gonna dislike the video, dislike the shit, you probably wearing a motherfucking skirt too. You feel me? But like the video if you feel where I'm coming from. You know, I was surprised. Was you surprised? Like the video, let me know. All right, number three. Why did you sell your soul to the devil? Why did you sell your soul to the devil? Now I get I get this uh, vibe that you know all the entertainers, all the rappers, artists, singing artists, whatever are now signing they signing they soul over to the devil. I don't understand why, you know. So you mean to tell me in order for me to be a millionaire, I got to give my soul to the devil and not worship Christ? That's fucked up. You feel me? That's, that's fucked up. Number four. Why did you get Kim Kardashian pregnant? That shit right there, I don't like. You know, that's fucked up on top of that. You know, here she is fucking another nigga in a video. Now it's exposed to the whole world. And out of all the females, I'm pretty sure it's a lot of females on your dick, you know, dick riding hard and shit, out of all the females, you gonna choose to get her pregnant. That's like me fucking a porno bitch and getting a porno bitch pregnant, knowing that all these motherfucking niggas hit that shit, and I'm the one that giving her a fucking baby. Am I right or am I wrong? Number five, I really got too much to say, but keep making good music. You know, I like your music. It's just simple fact that, like back then, one of the previous numbers, I said that you was wearing a skirt. I just like that shit. You know, fucking up hip hop. You ASAP Rocky. I don't know what the fuck he thinking and shit. Coming on 106 and probably with the fucking dress on and shit. But like that nigga got my mama dress on and shit. You know, some that sh that nigga took out the closet. I say to myself, do these niggas be thinking? When they out here performing on stage. I understand you got a lot of money and shit. But do you think before you act? Because you know damn well that shit was going to be on, on TMZ. 
It was gonna be everywhere. You feel me? World star. Cause I seen the video on World Star. And that was fucked up. That you had to wear a dress just to prove a point. You know, we, we know you got money, my nigga. We know you got money. And shit. But if I'm gonna be paying my damn money to come and see your ass, I expect for your ass to wear some pants or some sh or shorts. Not no fucking dress. Not no fucking leather skirt. Not no motherfucking mass over your head and shit. I don't know who the fuck you think you is, Sandman? Shit, I'm just being real, you know. But if you feel me, subscribe to this channel. You know, subscribe to my channel. If you dislike what I'm saying, fuck you. You know, I'm just being real. Fuck you. And fuck all the negative comments motherfuckers leaving on my page. Because regardless, I'm going to still continue to make more videos about motherfuckers that I dislike and some motherfuckers I do like. You feel me? But don't forget to check out all my other videos on Cortez Talk. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. And don't forget to comment below and let me know what you think about this video about Kanye. Alright, peace. I'm flexing, biatch!